Got the swing arm back on there. Shot. Nice and lubed. A lot of people talk about lubing the swing arm bolts and stuff. Everything's good and lubed. Think I may be losing my mind. Oh, I already lost it. Alright, trying to do some de-rusting here. Already got some CLR that I was using. I was testing out. It worked alright. So you can see the chemical reaction. I didn't use gloves with this stuff. Well, I'm not touching it anymore, but... I had like a small cut in my fingernail or something. Tell you what. Get um get a burn. <laughs> get a real burn. Say that. This is the the right side foot brake uh, kickstand. This is the uh, kickstart. Stuff's been sitting in the CLR about. What, 10 hours now it did remove a lot of the rust so you can see that greenish yellow color is now all brown and you can see all the residue at the bottom I just since it's not that deep and I don't want to buy no more uh, CLR I'm uh, I just basically flipped them over so each so all the sides can get you know anti-rush treatment but it's working and then what's left I should be able to just easily sand off or scrape off or use the colonel brass or whatever but at least it's loosening up the rust that that don't just fall off so see a lot works make sure you use gloves who I tell you that hands was burning a little bit when I didn't but Stuff works. Legal.
see how that works. Most of the rust is gone. Time to put this joint back together. Put it back in the same order that I took it off. Shocks, swing arms is the last thing I took off. And the forks and the bars, so. So we're gonna be starting with. Hopefully I ain't missing no parts. I could have did better organizing all the parts and screws and shit, but it what it is, huh? Go get it back together. Lego. Got the swing arm back on there, shot. Nice and lubed. A lot of people talk about lubing the swing arm bolts and stuff. Everything's good and lubed. Now we're gonna start with this side. Stator, side, magneto. Sprocket side. Make sure all the old um, gasket material is off. That's what I'm using. This stuff works real good. Combination of this. Let it sit as long as you can, really. At least 15 minutes, I say, and it starts coming off real easy. Plastic scraper. Probably gonna have to flip it over. It's getting a little dull. But yeah, got the new sprocket, front sprocket. We got a new rear sprocket too, having some trouble getting it off the wheel. So probably gonna take it in somewhere. Ask somebody to blow it out for me. But we're gonna get the rest of this stuff on. I didn't take the best pictures and the best records keeping all the bolts and everything together. So we're gonna be using the 
XR80 parts pack to guys. Same frame, pretty much a lot of the same bike, pretty much. Just the motor, really, and some cosmetic stuff. But legal.